Warning, the shoulder workout you're about to see in this video is definitely not for beginners. It actually exhausted me, and I've been working out for years. So even if you're an athlete, I still wouldn't recommend doing this shoulder workout all the time. It's one of those tough workouts that you do once in a while. So we start off with shoulder press. Um, you know, just a heavy shoulder press, 10 to 12 reps for four sets. I start off with a light weight on the first set and then, well light to moderate and then heavy the next three. Okay, we're going to do an inner shoulder press XFT style. And what we're going to do is start off with the lightest weight, doing that 15 times. Then we're going to move up to the next weight, do that 12 times. To the next weight, a little bit higher, doing that 10 times. To the next weight, a little bit higher, doing that 8 times. To the next weight, a little bit higher at the heaviest weight, doing that 6 times. So I'm starting off here with 10 pound dumbbells, 15 times, 12, 15 pound dumbbells, 12 times. 20 pound dumbbells 10 times, 25 pound dumbbells 8 times, and 30 pound dumbbells 6 times. And we're going to do this for 3 XFT sets. So we're going to do this whole thing 3 times. This may start off looking like another shoulder workout that I posted, but trust me, it's very different. We're going to do some front delt raises now, and we're going to do them also in an XFT sets. So it's just like the last exercise, except that with this one, we're only going to do four different weights instead of five different weights. And we're also going to go lighter because this is a harder exercise. So with this one, for example, I'm starting off with five pound dumbbells, doing them 15 times, 10 pound dumbbells, doing them 12 times, then 15 pound dumbbells, doing them 10 times, and 20 pound dumbbells, eight times. You're actually going to see me do some 25s here too because I was just feeling kind of beasty. But yeah, you're, you're only going to do four intervals of weight on this and you're going to do this for three sets like this on XFT. And although you see me doing five different weights instead of four different weights on this set, the other two sets I did only four weight intervals. Okay, now for some supersets. So on this superset, what we're going to do is we're going to start off with rear delt flies, and then we're going to go into shoulder push-ups. For the rear delt flies, you're going to do heavy weight, 10 to 12 reps. For the second exercise in the superset, like I said, we're going to do the shoulder push-ups. These may look like regular push-ups, but if you look, my hands are much further forward. We're going to do this for 15 reps, and we're going to do this superset three times. All right, now we're going to do some giant sets. For those of you that don't know what a giant set is, it's the same thing as a superset, but instead of two consecutive exercises, it's three consecutive exercises or more for one solid set. So for the first part of this giant set, what we're doing is these rear delt kind of weird different kind of rear delt flies. We kind of bring them up like a Y or a V. And for the second exercise in this giant set, we're going to do uh, this rear delt exercise right here, which is not a fly. Just do them as you see me doing them here. Bring them down, clicking the dumbbells together, and bring them up, squeezing the rear delts. Okay, and for the third exercise in this giant set, we're going to go and do Arnold presses. We're going to go for 12 or 15 reps. You're probably going to be pretty exhausted by this point. I know I am. I'm using 30 pound dumbbells here. So with giant sets, it's just like supersets, except it's three or more exercises instead of two. 
So we're going to do this giant set three times. So you do one exercise, a second exercise, a third exercise, and then you rest, and then you go and do it again, then rest, and do all three again. Same as you would do if you were doing a superset. As you can see for our next exercise here, we're going to do our side delt raises. Uh, we're going to do this for four sets, and we're going to hit 10 to 12 reps on each set. So whatever weight you can do 10 to 12 reps on each set, it's going to be moderately heavy. Okay, and then we're going to do three sets at 10 to 12 reps on this funky exercise right here. Okay, now we're going to do hang side one arm lateral raises. So you're going to do like you see me doing right here, and we're going to hit 12 to 15 reps on each side on this exercise. And we're going to do this exercise for three sets on each side. So we're going to go ahead on the first two sets, we're going to do the right, then the left, then the right again with no break in between, and then the left again. And then we'll take a quick break, catch your breath before you do the th third set on each side. And congratulate yourself, you just finished a killer workout. Have a protein shake. Also, check out some of my other workouts online.